Okay, everybody, let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to cover quite a lot today. Uh, <clears throat> so we can get a better understanding of kind of what's playing out and, and the parameters of uh, what needs to hold, needs to break in order for us to kind of confirm uh, the bigger picture. So we're going to start the S&P 500 with just some very basic technical analysis. This is our first bear market trend channel. This was for the C wave. As you can see, it uh, pretty much uh, bottled up any attempt by the bulls to reclaim new highs. And um, that, that was broken. And so we were looking for, on this date, this is one of, this was our big uh, major time factor we'd identified months in advance. <clears throat> And we were looking for something big to happen, basically. Uh, the trend was down. We were moving sideways into this. And what we got on the first day of this uh, of this time factor was a breakout above the um, bear market trend channel right here and just a complete continuation of this move. So this was a major inflection point, uh, which we used to really remove the bulk of our hedges and go net long. We added some back around the 40, 50 level, anticipating a pullback a little early on that, but I think it's still gonna be uh, logged as, as a gain and add some protection. So um, what's next is, this is the other bear market trend channel. And as you can see, we still have to break above this. 